Good morning, everybody. Hope everyone is safe from the storm that happened this past weekend. As uh, newscasters and forecasters go, you know, sometimes they underpredict, sometimes they overpredict, and it is what it is. But in any way, I hope everyone is safe and sound and enjoyed their, uh, their past weekend. Today, I wanted to speak about commitment and being committed. Uh, with anything that you do, whether it's a new job, a uh, new exercise routine, a nutritional program, new, uh, any new venture in your life, to stay committed to that is going to lead you to succeeding in what you set out to do. And people say to me all the time, well, if I do it 80%, what can I expect? And I always tell them, well, you should expect about 80% of the results. If you give it 100%, you're going to get 100% of the results that you put out. Um, and it's a, it's a simple adage. What you put in, you're going to get out. So if you put in 100%, you're going to get out 100%. You don't want to commit to something and not have the notion of, I want to succeed in it. When you commit to something, you want to stay committed, you want to be committed, and you want to be held accountable for what you're setting to do. So working with someone, um, have, being mentored by someone, being coached by someone is okay. And it's very acceptable and it's, it's great because sometimes we need assistance in getting ourselves to where we need to be. The longer you stay committed to something, uh, whether it's short-term goals or long-term goals, the, the, the more committed that you are, the more successful you're going to be. So if anyone is going to take anything from this little video that I just posted, is stay committed. Don't give up. There's always going to be bumps in the road. Be committed and stay focused and stay down the course that you've set out to do. Uh, have a great day, everybody, and uh, I'll speak to everyone real soon. Bye.